Welcome to Nickelodeon's Robot Wars, where today you're going to see five bots, four battles, and one winner on the Annihilator Special. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the master of mayhem, Dave Azer. Welcome to Nickelodeon Robot Wars. Today, a multi-bot battle of epic proportions, the Annihilator competition. It's a free-for-all as we start off with five robots, all in the arena at the same time, all trying to survive and move on to the next round. In each round, one robot will be eliminated until all but one are gone. That robot will be named the Annihilator Champion. Let's go down to the pits and get the mood from Vivian. Viv. You can just feel the pressure here in the pits, Dave. Roboteers making all sorts of last-minute repairs and adjustments to the machines, hoping that their robot's the one that's got the right stuff to make it into the finals and hopefully all the way into the winner's circle. Which one of these metallic monsters will end up on top? Well, there's only one way to find out. All right, Vivian, here's the lineup for the Annihilator in the first round. We're going to see Techno Trousers, Basenji, Buddy Attack, Hannibal, and the Peacemaker. With spinning discs, lifting arms, and even a sledgehammer, every weapon's represented here. So now, let's meet our team, starting with Andy. You're here with Basenji. So what makes you think that your robot can take out four other robots? Uh, we're very fast and agile, so we hope to use that to our advantage. Okay, Wait. well, we'll see. You're also going up against the Peacemaker, Hannah. What's your role in today's battle? I'm going to direct the saws. Okay, and maybe make pieces out of the other robots. Well, mm -hmm. we'll see. Head on over here. We'll meet Techno Trousers. We're here with Ellen and Andrew. Ellen, what do you think your robot has that none of the other robots have? Hydraulic lance. Ooh, the hydraulic lance. Watch out for it. Right over here, we've got Bunny Attack. Andrew is here. Andrew, which robot you think you're going to go after first? Basenji. Ooh, Basenji. All right. Well, let's meet the fifth team. It is Will. He's over here with Hannibal. Hannibal is his very own custom design. So, Will, what design feature do you think that can really take out the other robots? I think grabbing them and taking them to any hazard I want would be a lot, very helpful. Okay. Well, you met the team. Now sit tight for the Annihilator Special. From Massachusetts, Bunny Attack. First to enter the arena is Bunny Attack at 200 pounds. Nice bit of fur lining on there with an 8-pound sledgehammer, just in case you're sleeping. From Massachusetts, Techno Trousers. There's Techno Trousers at 185 pounds with a retractable coil and spear on it. Let's see how that one works. From Virginia, Hannibal. And there's Hannibal. Hannibal has got a lifting arm to tip over its opponent and a grabbing arm in at 194 pounds. From California, the Peacemaker. And in at 99 pounds, a lightest spot, the Peacemaker. With two circular saws with metal cutting capabilities, he's light and strong. From New York, Basenji. And there's the four-wheel drive, Basenji, in at 184 pounds with a six-inch hole saw that could cut through something if they got in the way. There's the Bunny Attack Techno Trousers teams up in the booth. And Peacemaker Hannibal and Basenji teams up in the booth. And the house bots guarding the corner patrol zones in this round will be Sir K. And joining Sir K, the capable hands of Sergeant Bash. Three, two, one, activate. Here we go for the first round of the Annihilator Special. It's a free-for-all where one bot goes out and the next four go through. Bunny attack gets attacked immediately, and the Peacemaker decides to go head up with the bunny at half the weight. And it's a bit of a free-for-all in the middle. Techno Trousers has got some loose suspenders. 
the teams look on, it's carnage down in the arena as Basenji slams the Peacemaker into the disc button. And that disc is spinning around. You don't want to drive over that thing if you got low center of gravity. It'll just take you for a ride. And Techno Trousers, it look like they've had a better ride in another day as the Peacemaker is getting cooled down by those CO2 jets. As Techno Trousers out of it, RefBot's having a look as Hannah Gary looks on for Peacemaker and RefBot goes to the countdown for Techno Trousers. These guys are well and truly out of it, it looks like. Yes, they are. The audience wants to see some kind of destruction here. The largest spot in this round goes out, and the four Techno Trousers guys can just sit and look. It only took him two weeks to build this robot. He was really up against it. Maybe he could have had three. As he goes for a little do -si do courtesy of Sir K. Bunny attack is still on the attack. And Hannibal's got some smoke coming up, and it's definitely a no-smoking area. As Techno Trousers gets lined up by Sergeant Bash, the audience knows something's gonna happen at all. Oh, Techno Trousers gets flipped into Bunny attack. Absolute insult to injury here. Poor Techno Trousers goes out early on and then has to suffer this right into the sledgehammer of bunny attack. So Techno Trousers is the first victim and the remaining four go through. All right, we're standing here with Andrew and Ellen from the Techno Trousers robot team. Hey guys, watching that match, uh, it was obvious that Sir K came over and he was able to uh, dismantle you, but is it frustrating to sit there and watch your robot and you can't do anything about it and then here comes Sir K and he breaks your leg pretty much. Is that tough to watch? Very. <laughs> well, I give you guys credit for battling up until the end, and I know you wanted to say something to Bunny Attack because they tried to help you out and give you a little push there at the end. What did you want to tell them? Thank you. And they say, you're welcome. Guys, give a big hand at Techno Trousers. They fought hard all the way to the end of the match. So with Techno Trousers history, Pasenji, Bunny Attack, Hannibal and the Peacemaker go through to round two of this Annihilator. And when we come back, the four remaining robotic gladiators will fight it out to see who will be the Nickelodeon Robot Wars Annihilator champion. You are watching Nick Gas.